So I've been looking for a bag for my Super 73 for some time now, and I finally found one that I really like, want to share it with you guys. Um, this is the brand Ortlieb, O-R-T-L-I-B. It's a waterproof bag, so it's nice when you're um, traveling in, in the uh, in the rain, it um, won't affect anything that's inside of it. It's really heavy duty and it's got these straps along the top, which I'm gonna show you how I mounted it. Cause that was one of the things that I was struggling with is how do I get this a bag mounted on the bike without having to really customize it very much. But it does hold quite a bit, you unzip it here. So I just keep like um, a lock in here for the bike itself. And then I have a backpack um, to, in case I need to carry something in there. Um, but you could see, it's got a good amount of space inside here. It also has um, some Velcro inside if you wanted to strap some things down. So I'm gonna show you um, how I mounted it because uh, it's kind of just cobbled together, so to speak, um, and then what it looks like when it's on, on the bike. So basically this is gonna hang from here like so, so that it doesn't um, affect anything when I'm riding and it kind of just hangs in the middle in that center space. So the first thing you need to do is take your battery off. So I just removed the battery. You can see the rails here where the battery goes. There's a slight bit of space under there. That's where, right under there is where I'm gonna put first Velcro. I'm gonna put the second Velcro underneath the seat. If you lift that up, you can get some clearance there. And then the third one without really taking these screws out and lining it under there, um, you just, it doesn't, you know, you just kinda gotta let it hang, which is fine. I've had it on for about three or four months now with no issues. So I'm gonna go ahead and mount this on here and then I'll show you what it looks like. So I got this mounted, so I basically just put this middle strap, this is where it's gonna hold most of the weight, um, ran it underneath the track for the battery here, and then just kind of folded this strap back across the middle. Um, this one I just let it hang free, and the only downside here is when you're going to zip it up, you kind of need to pull the, pull on this little corner as you zip the, the bag, otherwise it kind of pulls down a little bit, but that's okay. And then the third one, um, you run underneath the seat itself right under this little track here and then you can uh, it doesn't quite have enough to fit it back in so I kind of just tuck it underneath the seat like that so that it's not exposed but the bag is still hanging freely you could take a zip tie here there are some cables under here and you could zip around these cables and tie it directly to this strap and I'll show you how to do that here so there you go, I've, I've went through the, the loop, the hook on the uh, bag itself around these two cables here and zip tied that. I'll just cut that off and then um, it will stay hooked up here. And so that's kind of what it looks like after it's, it's done. Um, and it, it doesn't get in the way at all. Your legs are kind of free from the space. It gives you the ability to have a bag that, that runs underneath the vehicle. And um, you know, as I mentioned, it's waterproof holds everything I need to hold.